Okay, um, I just found a site which I want to recommend to people. Some of you may know it from a long time back, but it's new to me. I think it's absolutely fantastic. What it is, is Google News Timeline. And if you want to find it on the web, here it is. Here's the URL, HTTP News Timeline, googlelabs.com. Why do I like it? I like it because it offers excellent reading, listening, and actually vocabulary practice as well. The way it works is, it's a timeline, 16th to the 24th of December. Here it is, New Year's, sorry, Christmas Eve. I'm looking at Christmas. Wow. Um, and this is where it's kind of cool. We have different stories relating to the topic. They're all about Christmas. Now, what I can do, let's try and think of something different. I'm an IELTS teacher. I do lots of IELTS. So let's think of an IELTS topic. Let's go for health. Oops. Try again. H-E-A-R-T-H add query up the top and what do we get? We get lots of stories relating to health. Um, now, if you're an IELTS person, I think this is brilliant because reading is good for you but you probably don't have too much time. There's other things happening. So when you read, you want to read in a focused way and this site allows you to do that. All of these stories relate to health. Um, let's pick on one. Okay. Okay, um, one I've looked at before. Um, deal on health bill is reached. Click. And we go to the Washington Post and we have a nice little article for you to read about health. And neat here, we've got a video. Um, let's go back. The other thing I really like about this, it collects videos too. Really Protest outside or closed nursing, nursing home. home. And so that gives you a little bit of listening practice as well in a focused way. And this is what I call a little but often exercise. You're not going to use this every day, I don't suppose, but two, three times a week would be great. And as I say, it's good if you want to read, but read in a focused way.